Hey, what's up guys? Justin back here and today I have of course 8 awesome packs of none other than the BTO8 um, packs opening for you guys. So um, of course this set is um, one of the very anticipated sets because of cards like, you know, something like Great Dayusha, um, you have awesome um, awesome upgrades for clans such as um, Neo Nectar. You also have um, the the long lost clan that has been revived, Tachikaze, that hasn't been seen since um BTO three. Yeah. So um anyways, without further ado, um let me just go ahead and start cracking these packs open for you guys, alright? Hopefully I'm one of the first YouTubers to actually do this kind of thing for BTO eight. So let me just focus. You can see the packs are actually different. Just check out the blue and everything. I like the color, that's all. But anyways, that is aside from the point. I'm gonna open these packs for you guys, alright? So, pardon me uh, if I don't know most of the skills yet. Because uh, I haven't familiarized myself with the, the... Let me just go through the first few comments you see. Alright, this one is when it appears on the rear guard circle. Plus 2k for Dimension Police. This one is the counter blast one. Put one from your deck onto the damage zone. Then at the end of the turn, you return some, yeah, something like that. Yeah, this is the great one version for Aqua Force. All right, this is the new nectar version of this one. It's just that this is great two. Um, sometimes I feel like the 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 artwork is young used wrongly. But anyways, yeah, as you can see, like the the new new nectar um cards are awesome oh we have bto8 number one triple r it's uh all right off to an awesome start we start with great dayusha um personally i find that this is um it's, uh, overrated but um anyways the foiling for this set i quite like it lah but i mean this is actually very personal but i i sort of like it yeah, so this is the cross right for Dayusha. So we are off to a great start. Awesome, great Dayusha. Alright, so we are off to the second pack, guys. Um, of course, BTO8 comes with two kinds. There is the ones with the CD and without the CD. So yeah. So of course, no point. Still go through the comments for this one. This one is the Tachikaze. Um, when you boost this, the 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 unit which this unit boosts in, if the attack hits, um, you can return this to your hand. Not a lot of people use this card, anyways. This is uh relatively useless. This is for the zeal build for Dimension Police. Um, whenever your Opponent's Vanguard's power goes below 8k. Uh, you get 8k or below. This guy plus 3k. So um, you have to perfectly ride out the entire chain to get this guy out. Then this is of course the Sephiroth right chain for um, Neo Nectar. This is a great one. And the draw trigger for Dimension Police. Uh, Dimension Police now has a relatively good amount of um, triggers around, so yeah, we have a double R. It's 7k. Hmm. Alright, we have a Neo Nectar. Okay, this one is whenever this is in the rear guard circle and you have a Vanguard with the name, um, what is that? Musketeer. Alright, when this card attacks, it's a 10k. So um, like f to me uh the 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 new new nectar cards actually look very very nice. I mean I don't know about you guys but the the artwork is is like very nice. Is it like the 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 effect may not be that good but um the artwork is definitely um one of a kind. So yeah, on to the third pack right here. Um, this is the Aqua Force one. Whereby, um, when boosted by an Aqua Force, it gets plus 2k. When boosted, gets 2k. Then this one is the 
great nature. Let me see. Hmm, what is this? Something plus 3k. I have no idea what this is. Baba. Gong. Okay, no idea. Skip. <laughs> Sorry, guys. Oh, yeah, this is the new starter for the Narukami. Um, this one has quite a unique skill. Um, when you write a Narukami unit over this, uh, you can pull this to the rear guard circle. And during the main phase, you soul blast one and you can um, choose a Narukami unit and the, per the the passive skill goes away. So this card is actually to go with um, Dangari, the new grid tree um, Narukami card. Um, if I get it, I'll talk more about it. So anyways, uh, we have a stand trigger for New Nectar and then we have a uh, Maiden of Libra clone for uh, Dimension Police. So you can see this is like rewrite sort of like a like. Yeah, it's a double R um Otaku style, but anyways. Yeah guys, on to the fourth pack right here. So open the great Dayusha already. The rest are double R's. So we have no point. Alright, so let's go ahead. Um this one is the the counter plus one from top deck come into a damage zone the one that will help you get your limit break off faster then this one is the Tachikaze version of when boosted plus 2k so it's a 12k attacker the artwork actually looks not bad let me just focus alright there you go then oh this guy this guy is um, relatively special um, you don't see this in other um, other other clans because the effect of this guy is actually um you count the last one uh shoot uh okay you boost a new nectar and then if you you can pay a cost if the you counter plus one your opponent cannot um normal gut from the hand so that means he cannot call a gut from the hand he can only intercept so the the good thing about this card is like for example if you have a uh maiden of trailing rose in your vanguard and then if this this boosts the maiden of trailing rose and then the attack hits um he won't take a damage because of this card skill he won't take a damage but you are able to use uh maiden of trailing rose um persona blast so this is the purpose of this card so it's just it's just something like that lah. so yeah then we got the critical trigger for aqua force all right, we have a. This is uh shit. I forgot his name, but uh, it's a limit break unit for the Tachikaze, and the skill is actually very special. Also, uh, something about limit break four. Then you retire three of your units. Then if you have a great tree or above Vanguard, then you can write this or something. From your, ah oh, yeah, I forgot already lah. But anyways, yeah. Um. Yeah, you guys can go find out. Yeah, man. All right. So on to the fifth pack. Sorry, guys. I forgot the effect for that guy. Oh, damn son. Anyways, um, I'll just skim through right now. Um, plus, all right. BTO has really nice cards, guys. All right, we have a armed instructor bison. Um, basically, huh, not nothing much. It's just that to me, Leo Pound has more value than this guy. It's just that this is the first opening. That's why I'm going through uh, most of the cards you see right there. So, oh, there you go. We've got a Dangari. So, um, this is Dangari, the new Narukami Grade Three. So, um, this guy is actually relatively meh. But um, if let's say there is a improvement to this guy. Actually, when this guy just came out, I was very happy about the effect. It's just that uh, Bushiro did refinements to, to, to the misunderstandings people had about the effects. And then, like, I went, like, shit. So, anyways, um, the effect is um, quite a handful. Uh, so, pay attention. It's Limit Break 4. Counter Blast 1. You can retire any or one of your opponent's front row rear guards. And then, the second skill is that... Okay. I need to mention the third skill first before I can mention any other things. Which is, um, when this guy enters the Vanguard circle, you take the top two cards of your deck and put it into the bind zone, alright? 
So when you put the top two cards into the bind zone, uh, you counter blast one. Uh, limit break four counter blast one. You take one of those cards from your bind zone and put it back into the bottom of your deck. You can retire any one of your opponent's front rear guards. Front rear guards. Yeah, that's correct. But this 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 passive skill right here. Um, it's uh minus two k when you don't have any. Um, uh, don't have any binded cards that was binded by this guy in the bind zone anymore. So, if let's say you you use this guy. And then, um, it's just very difficult to explain to you guys. Um, I'll provide a link down in the description below. And there will be a write-up of me about this card. So you guys can go check it out. Um, I, I'll, there's a link right now on your screen. I'll put it in the description below also. And uh, you guys can go check this guy out. Um, basically, I know about this guy. It's just that it's very difficult to explain to you guys in a short period of time. Uh, because I feel... Like a bit, yeah. But anyways, this is the new right chain for Tachikaze, the Raptor series. Uh, yeah, there you go. This is the new, um, the new starter for Dimension Police, whereby you count plus one to find a great tree. So on to the <coughs> seventh pack. All right. No point. We get a double R. 9k Neo Nectar. Oh damn! I got two clones, two mid Libra clones in one box. So um, this one is Count Blast 2, then you draw one card when the attack hits. Of course, then of course you can see like the the artwork is of course as as beautiful as the ever. Yes. Yeah, so. Yep. On to the last pack, guys. Hopefully you like my opening this way instead of like just flashing through the cards. Let me know in the comment section down below which one you prefer. La. So, yeah guys, uh, this one would be a triple R, number 3. Um, 10k Neo Nectar, let me guess, Sephiroth. Yeah, there you go guys. This is a relatively gay card. If this wasn't a right chain, I'll definitely play it. Definitely play it if, if it wasn't a right chain. Um, it's just that I don't like um, inconsistent as in, I don't like um, right chains that much but anyways um, very happy to get um, this all, all the cards I, I got so far um, of course I didn't get Nilstrom or whatever but I still got um, cards that are pretty awesome so um, basically my triple R pulls are okay I got a Great Darusha which is off to a great start already. Then Dangari, which is meh. Then uh, Sephiroth, of course. Alright, then um, got. Um, sadly, I don't have any Aqua Force um, stuff. Yeah, I didn't get any Negators or whatever. That's quite sad. So, Neo Nectar, Vanilla, I mean, um, Combust 2 Drawing Card, then Arm Bison. Um, this, is, this is something Rex, la, I forgot already. Dark Rex, I think. Then uh, Operator Girl Mickey, then uh, this one I don't know. So anyway guys, um, thanks a lot for watching. Please do remember if you uh, if you like what you've seen, um, do, do let me know in the comment section down below as to you like this one better or you like my previous openings where I just open the packs and see what I get and just, just talk about the cut just a little because this one is more of an in-depth talk about the cards so um yeah guys please uh let me know know in the comment section down below um feel feel like being awesome just like my video subscribe to me um tell tell my channel to your friends and stuff uh support my channel and stuff so anyways thanks a lot for watching guys um i'll see you guys really really soon uh hopefully i can open a box of this for you guys and um yeah i'll see how it goes thanks a lot for watching guys take care